we like to say is we, uh, we carry America's heroes to their final resting place. I think that sounds pretty good. When I was growing up, I think I rode a horse twice, like on a Boy Scout thing or something. I, I consider the official stance of the Cap Force, as far as the Army is concerned, to be a little hazy. What it is, is they dated it back to Roman times, and back then they they were shrouding their, their horses or putting them in battle armor and escorting the fallen to their, their grave. If you turn the boots backwards to symbolize that the fallen won't ride again, that he's looking back on. pretty cold out there uh, in the summer that's no joke that's the summers get extremely hot right now is pretty much the, the best time to, to be out there it's, it's not too hot yet Memorial Day weekend is a uh, very busy around here we have a lot of people coming up here to, uh, to visit their family members we we're responsible for going out in the cemetery and placing the American flags next to all the, uh, the headstones you get a sense of how how many, uh, how many soldiers are buried in, in that cemetery. I guess working there every day, don't really think about it a whole lot, about how many uh, service members are buried out there, but uh, getting in there and planting all those flags. I feel pretty good about it. I think it's, uh, it's really rewarding. I think there's, there's a ton of challenges that come at you every day. I joined for four years of, of active duty with the infantry. And uh, I had, uh, no, did not, didn't even know about this place, really. And, uh, yeah, I wouldn't have seen this coming.